I'm Bella. And I'm Erica. And we are Apple, Apple and Tree. Tree. So today we have a really exciting video. We have a huge Bath and Body Works haul. We have one really big box and one kind of medium sized box and a ton of candles. So we're excited to show them to you guys. Yes, let's get started. So I'll start with our summer scents that we ordered. Um, we got actually two of these ice cream shop. The label is so adorable, I love that. And the notes are decadent almond, gooey toffee, creamy vanilla bean with essential oils. Now I don't usually mm. like, I don't like almond. I smell is the almonds. <laughs> no, I don't smell almond, I smell like chocolate. I don't get chocolate. Chocolate and like vanilla, smells a little bit like a vanilla fudge. Mm, yeah, to me it smells like the vanilla bean frappuccino from Starbucks. Oh yeah, I can see that. It smells really nice. I'm curious to see how this one burns. Love the label. I got two because it was so hyped up and people were... $24.50. That really is expensive. Mentioning it. Well, I don't ever pay $24.50. I right. always wait until the candles are on sale right. for at least like... Fourteen fifty if I have to, but twelve twenty five is better, and ten fifty is even better. And then if you have a coupon on top of that, it's just awesome. Okay, next I got Flamingo Beach, which is a repurchase for us. We yeah. got this earlier this summer. Oh, there's a little divot out of the wax, but what are you gonna do? At least it's not broken. We had That's great. two shattered candles in this order. The packing, I knew as soon as I picked up the box off the front porch when it got delivered, I was like, oh, this is not good when you can like feel things rumbling around in then your be, like, box of candles. Then you'd be like packed really tight in the packaging. So I knew there was broken glass really and there was two were broken and then one is damaged in a weird way and I'll show you. So anyway, this is really good. It smells really um, like fruity, almost like a fruity shampoo or like a really yummy hair conditioner or something. The notes are pink summer berries, juicy orange, dewy white petals. And this is just gorgeous. I highly recommend Flamingo Beach. We've burned through it once before. Let me show them, wait, the one that oh. is damaged in a weird way. So this um, Sunlit Cashmere is another repurchase. It smells really good, very that cashmere -y. Is... if you've ever smelled the fragrance oh by Donna Karen. Cashmere Mist, it's a lot like that. But That's what so Bella's weird. exclaiming is about is that They're the wax one wick. The wax is like pushed up. I don't know if you can see through the bottom, like it's the wax is not to the bottom, it's almost like it melted upside yeah, down. It's like floating. So there is it's magic. There's one wick that I can light. And the others are like almost level with the wax, so I'll probably to like melt the candle and actually get those out. Yeah, it's like really loose, like it almost feels like it's like like I could get just it out. Fell out when Mom shook it. So let me know if you have suggestions about what Gosh. I should do. Should I put that in the microwave face up and like melt that down a bit, or what? Let oh, me know, guys. Microwave safe. Okay, so the next one is ooh, is my personal favorite. It is a summer candle, like for the 4th of July. It's called Blueberry Pie. It has fireworks on it and a really pretty blue sky almost. And here is the interesting thing. Oops. We bought four. Yeah, we got four of those. I don't know where my other one is. Because they smell oh. so, so good. We got four. The, the label is just when this is a basic and gray. Oh, and I think it's awesome. It's got like these cutouts. You're so right, when you burn it, it, it should glow like through the cutouts. That which is really cool. I think it's a real nice I was talking too. about the lid. Oh, the lid is basic, yes. <laughs> I think it this smells, smells like, like blueberry pancakes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Also like the um the blue Tootsie Roll Pop. I don't know what that smells like. <laughs> it almost smells a little bit like grape or blueberry mixed with like a Okay, okay. Oh no, chocolatey gotcha, note. Gotcha. So it reminds me of when I was little and I have like this vague memory of the first day we started homeschool, because me and my brother are homeschooled. First day we started homeschool, we walked online in. school. Well yeah, online school. It's not homeschool. Well technically it is because we do the <laughs> we school. We do it at, at home, home but it's online public school. It is an online public school, but we don't go to a public school, it's an online public school. Mm -hmm. Um so I remember the first morning we woke up when we were going to start, like our new online public school, 
and we walked in and I got like a waft of blueberry because mom had made like she made eggs she made bacon and like blueberry pancakes to kind of like celebrate I guess our first day of homeschool so online school <laughs> mom <laughs> Okay, next, Same thing. this is one of the broken ones, but it's, oh, I'm lifting it because it's like, um, not like so bad it's going to cut me, but I don't know. Do you guys think I should burn this or not? There's something in there. There's like a little piece of paper in there. Here's what the inside looks like. Ooh. Let me know, guys. Do you think that's safe to burn? I don't think so, because I think like the glass is so weak. It he smells could, good, but it smells very could, light. Like, break up the glass Almost and then like it drip out. A really mild so cherry gross. slushy. Do you smell that? Or a really light cherry popsicle or something. It's kind I of get what it like, smells like you know like the lush lip scrubs kind of? Oh yeah. That's what I think it smells the like. The notes are chewy vanilla cream, fresh berries, juicy cherry. With essential oils. Or Kona Ice Tiger Blood. If you know what that is, the Kona Ice, then their flavor Tiger Blood, that's what it smells like. So here is the candle that came totally shattered. Um, if you can see, there's like a huge chunk of glass missing from Ooh, the top. Ooh, from like the other side, like that side. Oh gosh. Um, We're gonna get tons this. of broken glass. It smells really good. Okay, it's good. blue. I think it was like the Fiji. Ooh, ooh, mama. Ooh. Ooh, mama. White sands, it says. It's got a picture of a castle. I think it's real the similar cut the little to the paper holder. <laughs> Fiji, so that's that. Next we got suntan. Did we get multiples or I've, just one? This candle's been around a long time, but I've never had it. It smells nice. It smells like suntan lotion. I could see burning this on a summer day, like maybe when you've come home from the pool and you're enjoying your nice air-conditioned house. Yeah. Um, smells really good. It smells like suntan lotion, but like a little bit sweeter. So the notes are sun-kissed citrus, orange blossoms, coconut husk with essential oils. Okay, so the last candle, right? Mm -hmm. Last candle is Fiji White Sands, which has something on the bottom. Some of the label was poking off and it was hurting me. Fiji White Sands is a really pretty palm leaf label with a golden kind of sticker yeah this is a repurchase for us as yes. well and the label is, the lid is gold and it says a bath and body works this and it, smells oh, so good look and i just like think a, the I label is so pretty well, look at that top wick yeah i mean it's a little i mean it's not a big deal it's that a little interesting a little messed up i don't know if you guys can tell but it's not a big deal it's like the wax is like lifted. <sighs> it smells good. The notes are fresh cut sugar cane, white nectarine, and sandalwood. But I almost think it smells a little bit like um, a tropical pina colada drink or yeah. suntan lotion. It smells really beachy or like you're at the pool, um, but really good. Just really nice. Very summery. And our last item is this foaming hand soap called... London. It has a really pretty label showing like the city of London. There's a Ferris wheel, the castle, cars, Big Ben, and just another, another cute. So we cute loved the candle soap. London, which is tea and lemonade. And so <laughs> we grabbed the hand soap to see how we liked that. Let's smell it. Mmm, it smells good. I think it smells like mm. Elizabeth Arden's green tea smells perfume blooming. lotion line. Um, which also was how I felt the candle smelled as well. But this was six fifty, but I'm sure we got it for less. I don't remember, but probably two ninety five or three ninety five. I just thought that label was so cute. It so. smells like lemonade that has like a hundred grams of sugar in it. <laughs> well, now this London, they call it white tea and sage, which is interesting because I was assuming it was tea and lemon like the other one. And it says the notes are fresh tea, lemon, and herbs. So I guess sometimes, I don't know, I guess sometimes they label the soaps a little different. Who knew? Who knows? But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed our haul. Stay tuned for more candles from us. We're about to hit the stores and check out the new fall candles which are out. So be sure to like this video and subscribe so that you are notified when our next video is up. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. See you next time.